good morning, Builder News. This is Builder News, where web builders help other web builders by recording ourselves using other people's products for the first time. Um, so maybe I should update. Let's update this website just so that's clear. That it's about web builders. Web builders helping web builders. Web builders. This is Scroll Hub, by the way, and it's a ridiculously fast way to build and operate websites. We just edited that live. <laughs> Who needs staging? Who needs local host? I mean, look at that. Web builders helping web builders. Now, what's cool about this is, is don't worry, I'm not that reckless. We actually, we have this local one, so I can, oops. CD news, why isn't it? Oh, news.pub. Okay, get full. Ah! So um, that change I just made, I just backed it up to my old machine. So we're like, you know, we're, we're not reckless. Anyway, um, let's take a look at this thing. This looks interesting by Amelia, Amelia Wattenberger has, has made something new. LLMs as a tool for thought. Take a breath with me. As you breathe in, think about the air rushing into your lungs. Okay, I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna do this quiet because I can't be breathing and talking at the same time. So pardon me while I go silent for a moment. Okay, I think I'm done with the, the breathing. Taking something in, transform, send. That, this is true. I mean, in my language, it's parsing, transforming it, publish or compile or print or whatever. So the, the, the three step of consumption, transformation emission of publishing yeah that's interesting someone is speaking we're parsing thinking about analyzing and then response yes that's true So they've got, she's got some a visualization of the main points. Prompts are just a pile of context. Can I click on these? No. Oh, I can move them around. Oh, that's kind of fun. Little physics reactions. I like that. Ah, okay. So we're analyzing one of her posts. Okay. Chat box about the future. She does all these effects with the slide. What's the source code for this? What's she using? App immutable. Is there a generator here? Svelte? Svelte? Svelta? Yes, Svelte. What is that? I mean, I kind of know a bit, but I haven't used that in a long time. Now, does she have a link to the actual source? One, one thing I love is... Um, when you um, have a link to that source, like for instance on my blog, any blog post, her blog looks way better than mine by the way, but any blog post, if you just click on this little edit button, you, you can actually edit it. <laughs> and there's no off. Please don't vandalize my blog. <laughs> it's great, it's fast. Anyway, so so here is you can edit, this is the this is the source code um, and we can even um, or you could just like if you wanted to just look at the what building a tree basement why is that not a 
building a tree base with 6.5. Oh, interesting. I This particular file, I changed the permalink because, anyway, long story short, you can see the source code for, for any of my posts. So let's see if I can do the same with LLMs as a tool for thought. I don't know what, what the extension would be. Is it a Svelte file? JavaScript, maybe? Not sure. No. So it looks like she's using GitHub pages. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, I like this visualization. Rapid. So this is the parse, this is transform, this is publish. Parse, process, publish. PPP. I'm going to go with PPP. Yeah, so it's taking and transforming and sending out, I would say. Um, parse, process, publish. PPP. What a beautiful, beautiful blog. Yeah, it'd be cool if there was a... Oh, you know what I love? There's no copyright sign. Thank you. Thank you. Um, what I think would be really cool would be just a link to the source code for this post. I'm curious. I'm curious what's. I love these things, by the way. I'm curious what what's going on with this stuff. Interesting. Oh, I like this. I missed this the first time. Outside our working memory. Ah, so they need to zoom out. Oh, I've, that's kind of a neat little trick you got going there. What a cool post. Amelia Wattenberger. Tiny. Get him next. Oh, I actually, I think I almost worked there once. They were super nice. It was a fun interview process. But I, I don't remember what happened. Um, I had a second kid. <laughs> I think that's probably what happened. I forget. Um, I didn't. Beautiful stuff. Man, this is cool. Look at this. Awesome. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I've used some of her stuff before. Yes! I've used this before. Visualizing code bases. Client data. Yeah, what an amazing website this is. Thank you, Amelia. Two thumbs up. Cheers.